Ring, ring, ring. Ring, ring, ring. Bongo, bongo. Professor Panko here, and we are back for Story of Seasons Trio of Towns. We are here. This is Frank's place. I'll be taking my leave here. You'll notice my slightly Texan accent uh, for most of this video. I'm very proud of the fact that it is terrible, and I'm sharing it with you. <gasps> Who's there? Wait, is that you, Panko? Gasp! <gasps> There's a person! Hello. Ah, I thought so. Good to have you. Good to have you. I'm Frank. We shake hands. Just so you know, it's customary around these parts here to give you a hug when you're greeting folks. Wanna give it a try? <gasps> Gasp! Ha 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 ha! Yeah, I guess it's rather surprising getting told that right out of the blue. It was one surprise after another for me when I first got to West Town. Two, but it's turned out to be pretty nice. Just consider this pra uh, practice round if you like. You know, giving your uncle a hug when you see them. Like, this should not be so awkward. Oh my gosh, the hugging. So awkward. So, so awkward. I'm... There you go. Well, that was a good one. I'm sure it'll all seem confusing at first, but you'll do just fine. Once you've met enough folks and get a chance to hi, you'll get used to it. Oh, right. Still, they weren't lying when they said, Time flies. Look at how big you've gotten. Last I saw you, just a little baby. I bet you don't even remember me. Hmm, well, you see... Yeah, yeah, I remember you. Your pa sent me a letter explaining everything. First things first, though. You gotta be bushed after a long trip. Come in and settle down for a spell. All right. I shall do that. Awkward conversation over coffee. Right then, let's not forget why you're here. You want to become a farmer, yeah? It was real happy to hear that you want to do the same thing in life that I do. But don't forget, it's my nature herself you'll be tackling. Some days it can get real tough. You really sure you want to do this? <gasps> hmm. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Good answer. No wonder you were able to get that stubborn old bear Daryl back to back down. Now, I know I've said some uh, stuff that might scare you, but around these parts, the harder you work, the more my nature will reward you. That I can guarantee. Yay! <gasps> Oops. Sorry about that. Guess my stomach's reminded me we gotta get supper on the table. It's time to make some food, eh? You know what? I'll cook up some bright scrumptious in celebration of your new life. You just wait right there. That sounds great, Uncle Frank. Yummy, yummy food. Yummy, yummy food is being made for me. <gasps> pizza! This is some pizza. I'll be using veggies I grew in my own garden. Dig in. Nom, 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 nom. I have to come up with something to say with heart scoop above her head. Heart, 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 heart. Maybe. I'll think about that. Well, good, ain't it? Whenever you want to, recover your stamina. Hunker down and have a bite to eat. Sure, you can always get a little stamina back by eating berries and veggies and you can forge up in the wild. But when you really want to recover your stamina, a home-cooked meal is where it's at. Either way, just make sure you don't run out of stamina altogether. If you do, you'll collapse and nobody wants that. Nom 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 nom. Nom 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 nom. Nom 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 nom. Now then, time to hit the hay. You can use that bed right over there. Aw, oh, thanks, Uncle Frank. Oh, right, don't be forgetting to write in your journal before you go to sleep. Huh? So, this is the save screen, everybody. When you write in your journal, you can remember what progress you did that day and save your progress. It's a smart way to write in your journal at least once a day if you can. Whenever you want to go back to, uh, and remember what you're doing on another day, you can read your journal. You can always think back and remember any time you want. Your journal is really handy and you should give it a shot sometime. Now, I'd love to take you down to your farm first thing tomorrow, but it's still being worked on. Instead, I'll give you a grand tour of West Down. How does that sound? At any rate, it's time for bed. Good night, Panko. Alright, so we have to save a game. 
da, 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 we're gonna save over this top one. We are using Mr. Pineco's uh, a game because he is super nice and is letting us use his game. And we have now saved at Frank's house. So now that we've saved, we just press the B button and go back and we watch the next part of uh, the tour of Weston, which is our next cutscene. Yay! Weston is the first town you can visit and the place it's the place your uncle calls home. Morning, Pango. Did you sleep well? It's got a very country feel to it, which is why I'm speaking kind of weird. Today, I reckon I'll give you a tour of the town. But first, we better go say hello, howdy to Megan. She's the town elder, after all. Megan reminds me of Granny from the first story of Season Game, if any of you have played it. But, like, she doesn't die, so that's good. Megan's house is, build is the building down to the right of here. There is Megan's house. Very nice house. Come on, let's go. You'll also notice that everybody has very small farms. Very small farms. You are clearly going to be the most successful person at farming. This is how it should be. <gasps> Aha! Looks like the lupins are in bloom. Have a look, Panko. You'll get lots of wild lupin, aloe, and plum grass around this area. Wildflowers can make good presents for people. You can e even use some of them in cooking. When they're glittering, it, they're ready to harvest. Just walk up to one and press the A button to pick it. Right then, let's be on our way. Come on. Good morning to you, Megan. Who could possibly be talking to me this early in the morning? Hello, Frank. I've been waiting for you. Is this the relative you were telling me about? Yes, ma'am. This here is Banco. Oh. Ho, ho, ho. It's a pleasure to meet you, Panko. My name's Megan. I'm the town elder here in Weston. I'm also a farmer, just like Frank. I think I can speak for the whole town when I say we're very happy to have you here. Awkward hug. Hmm. What's wrong? Mama. She's a little shy about giving hugs. It looks like that's not a custom where Panko comes from. Oh, is that what it is? I see. Don't worry about it too much, Panko. You'll get used to it before long. Well then, let's be off to the grand tour, shall we? As you can see, this whole town is situated on a mountainside. It's very good for raising livestock. The red soil and hills and tall cliffs are some of the unique characteristics of this area. So this is a little part of Weston that you can see here. And this is, I believe, North or South Weston? North Weston? One of those two. I'll be able to say that a little bit more. The land here is perfect for farms. A lot of water and green veggies grow. You can be harvest stuff road down what up beyond the bridge leaves the center of town i pressed a too fast let's go walk this way first so i can tell you about the stores and other things of interest in the town you see that waterfall behind her is where we can find desi and offer her stuff you want to definitely uh throw desi some offerings because there's uh there's definitely the yeah offerings for desi good sentence building <laughs> Here we are, the heart of Weston. And this is Weston. Yeah, so the north, this is the north side of Weston, and so where the merchants are located, as well as the buffalo statue and all the ore mines. The town is divided in several levels, with staircases leading to each area. Well, what do you think? Long, long ago, it was a mining town, and a prosperous one at that, too. I think it's perfect. Now then, what about we stretch our legs a little? This way, come along. Ba -ba. Here you can find the grocer, the mineral store, the general store, and the animal shop. I'm sorry to say the mineral store is closed for renovations right now. It shouldn't be too long before it's open for business again, though. Just have a little patience until then. All of these stores are open from 10 to 1800 every day, so keep that in mind. Now, if I can direct your attention to the left. To the left, to the left, 
everything you own in a box to the left. Over here, we have the post office. If you ever feel like sending a letter to your family, stop over there. Though, right now, they aren't quite open yet, so you may have to wait a little bit to send those letters. Dun dun dun! Well now, speak of the devil, here comes our postman. Hello! <gasps> Good morning, Megan. Frank. Dun dun dun! Now everybody, meet bachelor candidate number one. His name is Wayne. His birthday is on spring 23. You get 1,000 friend points for giving him a cafe mocha, and 500 friend, po friend points for giving him coffee, iced cocoa, cappuccino, and baked cheese. You meet, uh, you officially meet Wayne on spring year two, uh, spring two of your first year, which is right now. What a surprise to see both of you here. What's the occasion? No, wait, let me guess. You're giving the grand tour to our new neighbor here, right? Ha ha ha. It's Jep, right on the spot as always. This is the relative I was telling you about. Aha, I knew it. The name was, give me a second, it'll come to me. Panko, right? Sounds just like butter. Yep, that that's my name. And now we get the zoom in. <laughs> I'm Wayne, West Town's postman. When Frank said he had a relative coming, I never expected someone as much of a looker as you. And you see in the corner there, that's the white flower. That is what you start with for all of your marriage candidates. We're always happy for any new residents around these parts, but someone as cute as you is especially welcome. And he's a charmer. I fear you come from a place real far away, Panko. Are you used to hugging people when you say howdy yet? No, I'm not. It's still very awkward. I mean, yes, totally. That should give me 500 front points right there. I'm looking forward to getting to know you better. Feel free to come over and chat whenever you want. I will. Anyway, if you'll excuse me, I've got some deliveries to make. See you around, Panko. I love the way they say bye. I love the, the motion of the waving of the hands. It's so funny. Well, yeah, those introductions are done. Let's continue on our tour, sh tour, shall we? Here are the other three most popular stores in town. The green building is the restaurant. The pink one is the florist. The yellow one is the general store. You can find crop seeds at both the florist and the general store, so I reckon you'll be coming this way more often than not. You reckon correctly. Oh, good morning, Megan. Good morning, Lizette. Good morning to you, Miranda. Panko, let me introduce you to Lizette, our florist, and Miranda, the owner of the general store. Lizette, Miranda, here's Panko, my relative that I was telling y'all about. Da -da -da. It's lovely to meet you. My name is Lizette. I take care of the flowers at the flower shop. All right, everybody, we have another introduction to make. This is Lizette. Her birthday is fall five. She get 1,000 friend points for giving her quiche and 5,000 friend points for giving her hydrangea, herb salad, peach, emerald, and mint. She is the, oh, the first female love interest that you meet, which again is also available spring two in the first year of your game, because that's today. Blah, blah, blah. La, 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 la. So you're Frank's niece. He's told me so much about you. I can't tell how happy I am to see that you're actually grown up. Because the only thing he really told me about you is that you were a baby. <laughs> Not awkward at all, hugging Lizette. Hey, it's nice to meet you, Panko. I'm Miranda. I run the general store. If you're looking for seeds, my shop is the best place to be. Sorry to cut things short, but I have some cleaning to do. I'll talk to you later. And my daughter's waiting on me for lunch. See you around, Panko. These little waves. Such cute waves. Moving along, let's have a look over this way. Over there's the clinic. If you're ever feeling tired or out of salt, stop by and see the doctor there. Just so you, just so you know, or sorry, just so you know, the doc is even sterner than I. 
He's off at some fancy's doctor seminar right now, so I'm afraid we can't introduce him to you just yet. He's supposed to be back later this week, though. You can introduce yourself to him then. And I ho there you have it. That's our little town of Weston. I hope you enjoyed your tour. Well, that's all for today. Now, if you don't mind, I have business to see you attend to back home. No, 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 no need to thank me. I enjoyed showing you around. You take care now, Panko. You hear? Since you're here, why don't you have a look around town for yourself? You know, familiarize yourself with the place so you can say hi to all the other folks. When you want to go into one of the buildings, just go up to the door and press the A button. Do you know how to talk to folks? Oh, you want to take a gander at your map? If not, I can explain it. We're going to say, yes, please, explain it to me, because we want to know everything about this game. Sure thing. When you want to talk to folks, you walk up and press the, press the A button. Or if you're just looking to nod a quick howdy for folks, press the press the L button. They'll say howdy back. Now, this is important. I want to say, the L button actually does a c count as talking to everybody, and it's really easy to do. So if you're trying to raise your friend points with all of the people in the game, as I will be trying to do, you're going to be pressing the L button a lot as you run through town. If you ever get lost, you can check your map to figure out where you're at. Take a gander at the touch screen. And so this is our map. The map will tell you where you are. It's the map. It's the map. You see that hat? Shows you where you are. Anyway, gonna head home. Once you got your fill, looking around and chatting, come on back. Just follow the road that goes south of here, and it'll take you straight there. Now, go on. Let everybody have a chance to say howdy. Later, Panko. Yay! So the tutorial in this game is long, guys. We are still in tutorial mode. This is still browsing. So I'm going to show you the difference. So I'm pressing A, a right now, and you can see all of the... Or a, a. I'm pressing L right now, so you can see all the people's faces. Um, and then, see? That's talking to them. What do you say, Panko? You're talking around town, eh? By the way, where are you from? If it's okay with you, I'd love to sit down and shoot the breeze sometime. That's Wayne. So you can go and run and say hi to everybody. And if you look at the, you can see everybody's faces. And I'll introduce you to some of the characters. This is Carrie. Heidi, wouldn't you happen to be Frank's relative? Pinko, was it? I heard you'd be moving in. Oh, it's so nice to finally meet you. I'm Carrie, and I'm in charge of the customer service at the Garden Grill. I didn't expect Frank's relative to be somebody so cute and stylish. Feel free to drop by whenever you're feeling hungry. Hey, I'm Brad. Let me guess, you're Frank's relative? I can see a little of him in you. I run the town's restaurant with my wife Carrie and my grandpa. Come by whenever you're feeling hungry here. It's good to meet you, Panko. And then if we go up the stairs to the restaurant, we find Grandpa. I mean, Marco. Well, howdy there. So you're Frank's relative, eh? I'm Marco. I run the restaurant in this here town with my grandson and my daughter-in-law. Well, I guess you could say my grandson runs it, but I help. Anyway, come back here when you're feeling hungry. I'll bake a mean cake. Yeah, do you better bake a mean, a mean cake. Oh, he hasn't fed me. All right, so this is the, this is the, 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 yep, yeah, restaurant. So let's go into the florist. Let's see Lizette again. Gosh, he came, already came to see me. Here's the town that's got it all. I think it'll be right up your alley, Panko. And again, you don't have to press A and talk to everybody this way. You can also press L and make the little uh, little music notes go about their head, and they'll talk to you. As you might expect, I love chatting folks ear off. That's why I love working here at the general store. I get to grab all kinds of folks. And if you go upstairs in her house, you get to meet her daughter, Noelle. Hi, nice to meet you. Hi, lady. Who are you? Did you know my mama? Oh, oh, I know. You're Pinko. I thought so. See, I heard Mama and Mr. Frank talking over it, and Mr. Frank said his relative was moving in so soon. I'm Noelle. I, you look like a nice person. Let's play together sometime. Yep, that's a kid. She's really cute. All right, let's go. I think we've met everybody in town. We're going to run down these stairs because we can't meet the doctor yet. The doctor. Do, 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 do. Let's run, run, run. We're exploring. There's... Oh, who are you? You're Horatio. You're a new face around these parts? This is the part-time job agency. Ooh, that's right, folks. There's part-time jobs in this game. Do you want to go? Yeah, I'm ready to go back now. Do, 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 do
Welcome back, Banco! Had enough looking around? I did. You gotta pl be plum tuckered out by now. Let's make supper and call it a day. That sounds good, Frank. I want my farm. Phew! I reckon I'm about ready to fall into the sweet embrace of a food coma. What do you say? Let's get ready for bed. Um, when's my farm gonna be ready? Wow, I got some help. It'll be all squared away today, actually. I'll take you over there tomorrow. Hooray! Can't wait to get our farm. Let's hit the hay. I'll tell you more about your farm in the morning. Oh, and be sure to write in that journal of yours before you go to sleep. Good night. Alright, guys. I want to thank you guys all for watching the second episode. And I hope that all of your crops are golden.